Welcome to the HTML tutorial series. This is lesson number 32. And in this lesson, we're going to be taking a look at the max length HTML attribute. So basically what that's going to do is it's going to limit the number of characters that a user can enter in to a particular input field. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing that you want to do is make sure that you have the HTML document open that we've been working on throughout this series. If you have that open, the next thing you want to do is look for an input field where you want to limit the number of characters a user can enter. In this particular case, I'm going to use the username input field. And right after the word required, I'm going to type the word max length. And that's going to be our name. And then for the value, we're going to set it to equals. And in quotes, we're going to type the word 15. I'm sorry, the number 15. And with HTML attributes, you want to make sure that you have it in name value pairs with the exception of the previous tutorial where I told you that the require attribute is an exception to that. But typically you want to make sure you have the HTML attributes in name value pairs. So in this case, the name will be max length and the value will equal the number 15 in quotes. So let's go ahead and hit control S to save that, and then open it in our web browser. Once you have that open in your web browser, let's go ahead and type some text into the username field. And we're just going to type in some random information until it stops us from typing any additional characters. You'll notice that I can no longer type any more characters. And that is basically limiting us to 15 characters. No additional characters can be typed at this point. So that is how you use the max length HTML attribute. If you found this video to be helpful, definitely leave a thumbs up, embed, comment, share, and subscribe. And stay tuned for future videos.